Hello, Team Grit. My name is Sharon Zellin from Long Island, New York, and I came on here to talk to Team Grit because your fearless leader, Michaela, and I were chatting, and I know that this month you are all working super hard to hit your national title. And just in case you forgot, Team Grit means you guys, you got grit, you got heart, you can do whatever you need to do to get the job done, just in case you needed a little reminder. So I wanted to pop on here to tell you guys, we need you, we want you. It is such a valuable place to be. Michaela gets all the ins and outs before everybody else does. You want to remain a national team. And I know you guys are all working really hard to do that. So I wanted to just come on and give you a couple of tips. Sometimes you hear something and you're like, oh, I haven't done that before. So let's just rattle off a couple of things. So a Cinderella challenge. If you haven't done that, the first time I did one, mine was like over $5,000. And Michaela will explain that, you know, the details if you need any, or you can reach out to me. It is super simple. You just send out a project broadcast, or if you don't use project broadcast, a customer connection email multiple times during the week that you're running this. And you just ask them to make a purchase from your $25 and under link, which is on everybody's website. And anyone who purchases at least $25 will get a ticket and a drawing. And you give away whatever you have in your home if you have inventory, or if you have PC dollars, just pick like a fabulous product, not a brownie pan, something great that people would want so if you have it great maybe one of the electrics that you haven't used or you know given as a gift or PC dollars pick something great and that's a Cinderella challenge and people love to be involved in like a contest and they will make a purchase and most of them make way more than a $25 purchase so the sales on that rises really quickly if you have not done recently, like within the last six months, a customer appreciation shared rewards party, I highly suggest you do that. I did one last month, it was $8,000 guys, because this is the time of year that everybody is shopping. So if you and your team are working hard to get paid a title, that is definitely a great thing to do as well. Turkey Trot, if you've never heard of that, it's a simple catalog show. If someone collects $200 in orders, they get any product or set at 60% off and any one product or set at 50% off. So put something out like a customer connection email. Would you like to do a turkey trot? And anyone that collects you know, $200 will get A and B. People love to get an incentive. They want something big, now you're giving it to them for 60% off and a bonus any one product or set at 50% off. Last year at this time, I had like 15 turkey trots going and of course they collect more than $200, right? When they show the catalog around, I sent everyone like two catalogs, I gave them the link and that was a huge success too. So you definitely have lots of things that you can do this month for sales for you and your teams. And then I wanna to talk to you a little bit about recruiting because we need new team members. We always need new team members, right? So with this $25 kit, I'm gonna encourage you guys, your friends, your family, who's looking for some extra income for the holidays. In the next five, six weeks, someone could realistically earn $1,000 and more so that they can have a debt-free Christmas or Hanukkah. So I'm gonna encourage you to ask your friends and family, right? There are signs up all the time, holiday help needed, hiring for the holidays. So are we a Pampered Chef. So make sure you're asking friends and family. Make sure you are making a promise to yourself that you will ask your host five times. Just because they said, oh, I don't know, the first or the second time you asked them, it doesn't mean that's a hard no. A hard no is one thing. I'm never obnoxious and I don't ask after a hard no. But if someone's like, I don't know, I'll see, it is our responsibility to keep going back and offering that opportunity until you submit that show. So let's make a promise that we are gonna ask our hosts five times until they say no. All of the guests in your party, when you send a thank you message, right? We all remember to say thank you and ask for a booking. How about in that thank you message saying, I'm looking for great people to join my team. Are you interested in a side gig? Are you interested in earning some extra money for the holidays? So ask everyone. I promise you guys, this is the time of year people are looking for extra money. So Team Grit, we got this. We're gonna come together because you didn't get the name Team Grit 
for no reason. You guys got what it takes and we can do this. If you need any help, reach out to me. Bye guys. Have a great November.